Hi beauties. Today I'm really excited. We're doing a, I want to call it a quick haul, but it's probably gonna be a long video because we bought a lot. Backstory, if you're new to the channel, welcome. I'm so happy you're here. Thank you for joining us. We're in the process of buying a house. We're also obsessed with Halloween. So right now I am like, focused on home goods and Halloween things. That's it. We're hoping to move in the beginning of November. So most of this Halloween stuff will not get put up in our house until next year. It do be like that sometimes. But I wanted to go ahead and pick up some goodies and then also share with you guys some things that I've done um, with the intention of like, it's going to be used to organize the house. So these two hauls are from Michaels and Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree is one of my favorite places to buy like really anything decorations especially, um, and also surprisingly enough dishware. I'll get into it, but we'll, we'll, I'll show you guys what, you know, we're talking about what we're thinking, but let's jump into it. I was trying to come up with a smart way to organize my makeup. I wanted something I could grow into and I wanted something that I could change easily and move around easily. So I thought like, let me get little containers, like little, I have a couple little like decorative open containers that I put palettes in sometimes and I really like them. So I was like, let me see if I can find some more like that and I can store my palettes in it and then I can add as many as I need whenever I need. So Michaels was having a basket sale and they were 60% off. So these are normally $20 and I paid $7.99 for each of them. I love them. They're so cute. They've got this nice little wooden handle. They're big. They're like 15.75 inches long. So they're huge, which is wound up being an issue, bigger issue than I realized. And then they've got this nice like metal frame and you can fit so much in them. So I'm thinking, what do I need for my current stash? And what do I need to grow into? I was thinking it was gonna take like 10, <laughs> to fill my current stash. And then I would maybe need like a, like five to, to 10 more to grow into, so I bought 20. Well, I currently have my entire makeup collection fit in one drawer, two other containers, and six of these. And I still have nine more to show up. So we have a lot, uh, more than we needed. I, I'm glad because I wanna have like six to eight as like a backup to grow into. Um, and then we'll use them elsewhere around the house. We could probably use them in the pantry or in the guest bathroom, or I can use them to put like hair products in, in our closet, in our bathroom. So they will get used. That's what my mom was like, you could take some back. And I was like, well, I could, and I probably should, but I'm not going to, I'm gonna save them because I would rather have this many matching so that way I can use them as necessary. So I did pick up that and I really like, um, I did reorganize my makeup just while we're here. I do like, how it's kind of laid out and everything um, at the moment. So I'm hoping this is going to be an effective system at least for a little while. So I got a whole bunch, a whole butt ton of those, if you will. And I also picked up two other baskets, just one of each, not a crazy number like I did with this. This one is also $7.99. It's just a nice metal basket, little wire basket. Um, and I got this one for like kitchen storage. I was thinking vegetables or fruits or something I could stick in this. And I really liked it. Kind of has that like rustic farm table feel to it. So I liked it and I was like, all right, let's go with it. So I bought one of those. I also got this. Originally I thought maybe the kitchen as well, but then when I had it in my cart, I was thinking, well, maybe it would be good for perfume. So that's what I have in it currently, my perfumes. I did, like I said, I reorganized. So I did go ahead and use this and uh, it, it's nice, it's cute. It really looks nice. And I, I think no matter what, it's gonna wind up staying in the studio because I really like the whole vibe of it. So yeah, I guess I could always buy another one if I wanted one for the kitchen, but like I probably shouldn't do that. So I probably have enough. Michael's was also having a Halloween sale. And you guys know Halloween is like, it's my time to thrive. So the first thing, I was so excited about this. This was also $5.99. Wait, I also, everything else was $7.99. So this was $5.99, not also, just it was, it just was $5.99. It's a bowl, right? It's a pretty little bowl. And they're angel wings and they're black. And our name is Dark Angel Beauty. So I could not get it. I was like, I, I have to, I have to own this. So, and I love it. It actually, I wasn't sure what to expect. I was like, it could be meh when I get it, but I really actually love the way it looks. Um, this is one of those things. I did not buy it for Halloween. I bought this to sit out year round, whether it's in the studio or it's in my bedroom, whatever. It's because why would I not buy it? So yeah, I was really excited with it and I really liked the way it turned out. I also, this was also $5.99. I got uh, this little sign. It says head witch in charge. Cause guess, <laughs> guess who's the head witch in charge in our house? It's me and Nikki knows it. It's also gonna sit out year round, probably in my studio. Maybe not, I don't know. 
It made me, I don't know, we may move it around the house. I don't know, but it's gonna be out year round. I promise that. All right, last thing from Michaels. I would leave this out year round, except it does say Halloween. So I'm like, oh, all right, it'll probably be a Halloween thing, but it's a super cool picture frame. I paid $9.99 for it. It's a skull. It's got the moon phases. And then it says Halloween here at the bottom. I love it. It's huge. I'm probably gonna hang it in our entryway so that when people come in during Halloween time, they can be like, ah, oh, guess you guys like Halloween. I'll be like, yeah. That's it. That's done for Michaels. That's all we bought for Michaels. It was a lot, but, and we're still waiting on nine more of those baskets to show up, but you know what, whatever. So then we went to Dollar Tree because I wanted to buy plates. And this is the talking about the dinnerware. In our apartment, we bought these teal plates that are nice and glass. They're, I mean, ceramic, they're nice and heavy plates. And then we bought black bowls and I loved them. They were the best quality, absolutely loved them. They're a dollar a piece. Every other place I've shopped for plates and stuff like that has been like $75 and you get a set of 12 and it comes with four bowls and four plates and four cups or something like that. And I'm like, I don't wanna do that. So they have a, currently have a pumpkin collection and then they have a marble collection they just released. The pumpkin collection is limited edition cause it's for fall. And the marble collection, I believe is a new addition to their their wear. We got up early, early this morning. We went where it is they opened, could not find them. We went to two different locations. They did not have anywhere near enough what we were looking for. Most of them didn't have anything. So we're gonna order them online because we can do that and have them ship to the store and then go pick them up. So that those will come, but that is why we went. We picked up a couple things drinkware wise and we picked up a lot of Halloween decorations. So that's what we're gonna show you guys. Nikki did not grab them in the bowl, so I'm not gonna bother showing you guys that. But because we're building a bar, I highly recommend if you guys have a Dollar Tree near you, their drinkware, this thing could kill somebody. It's so damn heavy. It's a dollar and it's a, it's a, I think it's a 26 ounce Stein. It's huge. So highly recommend. Just for comparison purposes, this is my um, completely non-alcoholic drink. It's in a pitcher. They're like, they're not that different in size. So, and this one is way heavier. This one literally, I feel like I really could bash Nikki's head in one set if I wanted to. That smile, that damn smile. Hello. Hello. I'm in danger. All right, so Halloween stuff. First of all, look at him. He's a little lantern, you put little lights in him and he's a pumpkin. We bought six. We bought six of them because they were a dollar and I said, I probably want more than six, but we'll go with six because that seems like a not crazy number. Then we got two of these little skeleton men. They hang and they're so fresh. This is, this is my issue with Halloween stuff. I buy Halloween stuff and I go, I would I would leave this up year round. Like he could hang from my ceiling all the, all the time and I would be absolutely fine with that. So like at what point am I decorating and at what point am I just like designing my interior? I don't know. We'll have to see what happens when the house actually comes into our possession and we can actually decorate it. I feel like it's gonna be a lot of just skulls, so. But yeah, I loved him. I was like, we gotta get him. They had like a witch and a ghost too, but I liked him the most. So we got two of him. This one actually, I saw my GM, she picked one up. A, oh my God, it keeps spinning. He, she picked one up for our store and we have a lot of Halloween stuff from last year. I actually did a video last year where I bought stuff for our store and I, I decorated it. But she had gotten one of these and she was like, oh my God, it was so cute. I had to get it. And I was like, I want it. So this one says family, friends, and football. So it's just like a one that you can leave up all fall long. And I loved it. So I was like, I gotta, I gotta get one. I mean, it's, it's a dollar. So that's what, I just kept saying like, it's a dollar. And then we spent 60 bucks and we didn't even get the plates that we were going in to get, so. The next thing we got are these little door hangers. You hang them on their, on your, um, on your doorknobs. And then they, when people turn them, they jingle. So we got one of each color. They got a, there's a green and a purple and an orange. And there was only one purple. So I would have probably gotten more purple cause purple is probably like my favorite color, but I loved them. I thought they were precious and I could keep saying it, but they're only a dollar. So like, why not? Right? Like might as well. Then Nikki found these, they're skulls. I can never have enough skulls. I leave them up year round. This one right here, this one right here. Just all the skulls. So we got we got the rest of them that they had, and it was we had they had three. So we got three of those. Then we got this sign. It says beware, because you know beware. And then we got this sign. It says beware, but in a different color, because I wanted to make sure you are aware. 
that we are dangerous. Then we got the pumpkin stack, cause precious. The happy pumpkin, cause precious. We got the happy ghost. Oh, he broke. It's fine, I'm a little broke too. Cause precious. We got this pumpkin scarecrow. And I would have bought more because he has like a stand, but the rest of them were like yard steak ones. And I really don't like, they're not that great of quality. So I didn't really want to stick them out in our front yard. Cause I felt like, like the first time a, a windstorm would come by, he'd just be dead. So I said, I, I'm not going to do that to you guys. I want you to live a long, prosperous life. So I bought the only one that had the bottom stand. So he's all alone, but he's got us. So he's still all alone because we're not great. All right, this bag's all ripped because there's a lot of signs in this one, but we're going to rapid fire this one. We got another happy pumpkin. He's so happy and he's glittery. Love glitter. We got another happy pumpkin, but this one says happy Halloween too. So then we've got mixing it up. We got a happy ghost. Did we already have a happy ghost? Yeah, we did. He doesn't look happy, but he's haunting. So obviously he's happy. Then we've got this one. I love this one. This one says happy Halloween and it's got a coffin. It says witches beware, spooky, boo, creepy and haunted. Love it. Then we've got this one, which once again, not entirely sure. I'm not gonna leave this one up year round cause I love it. It says join our black hats society, inquire inside. I love it. I love it. This one, uh, there's no question. This one's definitely gonna be up year round. It's probably gonna hang above my um, filming studio, which will have all my makeup and everything in it. And it says welcome. And it's got like all these like little jars, like apothecary jars. And then there's a happy pumpkin. And the colors are so pretty. I love it. Do you guys know that everything that I bought, I love? That went pretty quickly, actually. I, I really did rapid fire that. Hi. Go team. Yeah. So we didn't buy our plates. We didn't buy our bowls, but we did buy a whole bunch of stuff that we will not be able to hang until next year. So yeah, I will keep you guys updated if we do get the bowls and the plates in. I think we're going to order them online and then go pick them up at the store. That seems like the easiest way to do it to ensure that we get as many as we want. Because like I said, we went to two and they just didn't have what we needed. So when they come in, I'll probably just really quickly maybe like add it to another haul or something and show you guys. I'm sure there's a lot of household hauls coming soon because we really are starting to think like, what do we want to do for the house? Getting inside the house is the most important thing right now. We don't know exactly when that's gonna be, but we have a feeling it's gonna be either the middle to end of November or the very beginning of December. So we're just kind of playing it by ear and, and coasting along and doing what we can until then. So yeah, if you wanna join our journey, we would love for you to be with us please consider subscribing. We would love for you to be part of the Dark Angel family. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. It helps us a ton. And other than that, I hope you guys are all safe, healthy. You have a wonderful day and you stay girly with a dark twist.